101 to 90, Nets lead it. Play of the game presented by Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% on car insurance. And this one brought the bench to their feet. Carter, a little Vinsane. That's what I call taking them to the streets. Vince Carter taking them to the playgrounds with the breakdown of the entire defense and then finishing. One assist shy of a triple-double for Vince Carter. And what it will come down to is somebody making a shot because Gary Payton at this stage in his career, not just this stage, but Vince Carter's superior offensively, cannot contain him one-on-one. -on -one. Walker penetration, and hits the little floater. Tough shot from Antoine Walker. 101-92, Nets have to get it in. They do to Carter. Carter has only one triple-double in his NBA career. Happened back in April of 2000 against the Cleveland Cavaliers. Now the Nets playing a game of keep away. Use the clock. Carter catches. Six to shoot. Way outside. Carter missed it. Williams races ahead. Payton fakes on a three. Walker takes the three. Rims out. And rebounded by Carter. Long lead feed. Jefferson to the rim. He's got it. The slam and the foul. And Carter will get the assist for his second career triple-double. The gang rebounded by the Nets. Collins active. Vince Carter then recognizing Richard Jefferson's all by himself. The finish and the foul. 27 points, 13 rebounds, 10 assists for Carter. And that will be the 70th triple-double in Nets history. Matching the same mark that Jason Kidd has individually. That is a joke. <laughs> 70 triple-doubles for an individual. That's and special. Jefferson completes the three-point play.